Let me say this one time It's really not that. Technically, <laughs> I'm just not amazed and wowed by this place. So we're gonna do a little bit of a bedroom refresh and it's also gonna tie into the living room because things like this shelf is going straight to the couch and I just feel like this bedroom is a good size but I just like a more minimalistic look and this is some chaos. Also, I'm just gonna turn on the light now because it's a different look. <laughs> and I just, I don't know why, I just wanted the vibes to be vibing. So that's why I had the light on. I will show you my place in the daytime. It's a different feel. So we have our little bar cart here, but I think I want to put the shelf over here. It's a little lopsided because our carpet doesn't reach to the end, so I cut some cardboard. fits pretty perfectly it makes me enjoy this gray couch a little better because it lightens it up everything here is super white and then my couch is pretty dark so this kind of brightens the whole place up and I know I just said this is gonna be a makeover in my bedroom but <laughs> seems like we're gonna continue redecorating the living room because I I got this cool paper lamp um, for the living room, so I just set it up. I think it's gonna be pretty easy, so I'll probably do it. I think I think I did it. So this is the look that we have going on now. I'm just going to turn this on too. Just turn off all the big lights. Ah, what a dream. I feel like the lights just add some ambiance. So we have this. I think I'm just gonna put all the books out on in the living room. I have more in my office, but I want to just create like a book wall since I don't know where to put it. And I feel like this could just move down this way and it'll be a look too.
Okay, y'all. So I have been making a lot of like stuff from scratch. I feel like it kind of helps me feel healthier <laughs> knowing what is exactly going in my body, especially when I'm eating desserts and a lot of pastries. So today, we're gonna make chocolate chip cookies from scratch. So a lot of people may think I'm good at baking and cooking, but honestly, I just find the instructions online and then just try doing it. And it's been working out, so that's why I have been enjoying the baking portion of this. So let's try to make cookies because I kind of am in the mood for some. Should put this in the fridge or just go because it is a little more runnier than I wanted, but I don't want to add like sticks onto you. So I'm just gonna freeze it for about an hour or so just to make sure it is not this. We desperately need to go to the grocery store, so I just found like some pudak and like three dumplings I had, and then I made it into like a soupy ramen. Which I low-key like more than like the pudak version, like the stir-fry noodles. The secret is to put the dumplings into the air fryer first because they don't get soggy and I hate soggy dumplings. And exhale, sigh it out through your mouth as you lower your eyes. One more deep breath in, reach your arms up. And exhale, sigh it out. Beautiful. Hold in your plank now. Three. In, step out. And in, two. And a one. Hold in your spine. Really draw your navel in. Seven. Six. Five. Yeah, it's a tradition of cooking. Yeah. Okay, it's the big three that's downstairs. Very thoughtful. Hey, girly pops. Mmm. it in. So I'm back at my parents and we have to get ready in about 10 minutes. This is the um, house I grew up in in LA. So I forgot my whole makeup bag at home even though I packed it. So I'm here using my mom's. Thankfully she has some. And you can see that my hair is a completely different color and back to being dark. Um, so I had this whole like 
episode, let's say. It was like Saturday at 9 p.m. Andy just left me to go somewhere. And I was like, dude, this blonde hair is just like not it on me. And then I grabbed my overtone conditioner and just literally full scent it. And then my hair turned green. Oh my god. So now god. I have to like color correct it to this like reddish color for now. But I wanted to recap for you guys so you guys are like not confused as to why my hair is dark again. Dates. <laughs> hey, Oma. Oma, it's okay. Oh. I'll see you outside because I gotta go. <laughs> The photo booth is such a sleigh. I'm gonna give this to my mom and then to Andy and then put it on the refrigerator so they're obsessed with me. So the rain is low-key kind of messing with my plans because I wanted to get lunch at a cafe and then maybe like take content and stuff but it's looking like that's not gonna happen. But um, my second appointment I have to get to is called the new bar and it's for people who don't actually want to drink alcohol all the time you know for people who want an extensive wine selection but for the non-alcoholic drinks so um, I want to go to their store and just like pick out a couple of items and just see their collection firsthand it's pretty close from here so let's go Oh, you guys have spirits. Yeah, so a variety of different tequilas and stuff. I recommend the rum, the uh -huh. regular rum. It's quite delicious. The top is also another one of my favorites. Uh -huh. It's a blind by Shiso. Um, Dancing line is uh -huh. my favorite rum in the system. Yeah. The uh, kit is also quite great too. This is Visitor. It's a very light. of the day was getting some Japanese beauty store products. I was trying to make a TikTok in there but then this parking only lasts 10 minutes or I have to pay valet which is $10 now. I grew up here and the valet at the Chapman Plaza used to be like $3 and now they're charging $10 so blows my mind and we're not going to be paying $10 for parking. Um, I'm back home. Another day, another day of events. Or we just have one event. I don't know why I'm squatting. As usual, we are cutting it close to the time we have to actually be there. So let's go. <laughs>
in Changsha event. The team was so nice and they let us take any flower arrangements home because they're going back to Korea. But look at how gorgeous these are. And these vases, they just fit the vibe so much. Oh my God. We're also going snowboarding this weekend. Do I know how to snowboard? No, not at all. He used to be a rebel in high school. Here's what she said when she was in high school. Are you excited to go snowboarding? I'm pretty excited. I haven't been in a couple of years. So uh, let's see how many times I eat shit today. So I'm on the bunny slope because I can't really see very well. Um, and then I'm gonna meet up with them after like two more rounds of this so that I can get a little better. <laughs> the rest of the day and endorphins come in, serotonin comes in, so all the good stuff. Ready to eat breakfast now. Let's see if the boys are finally awake. <laughs> good morning! <laughs> hey! Good morning, honey. Good morning! Wake up, my beautiful darlings. Hey Ali, you miss your mommy. Why are you whining? Ali? <gasps> Daddy's alive. so easy to make from Costco, baby. Go eat. Go eat your food. Someday, I will see the Also, my hair is like completely different colors, <laughs> but it's okay because I made a hair appointment. Well, we will have. Guys, I don't know what it is about the mall on a Monday, 
at like 10 a.m. that it just gets my heart pumping. It's like my favorite time to go to the mall because of how empty it is. So um, let's just go. It's really bright. Ooh, the price went up by two dollars. I feel like the Anastasia brow gel is going viral right now. It's almost sold out. So. So we are at the hair salon now. I really need to do my hair. Hopefully I could dye my hair back to my natural hair color, but I feel like we're gonna have to take it red first, um, just because that's just how hair colors work, I guess. I vlog a little bit, but probably not too much, just because, I don't know. I just wanna relax today. <laughs> I rushed out to hair salon so I couldn't even get an after clip in there but like this is how it looks it pretty much just looks like my natural hair color completely opposite from yours Oliver I don't even know why I was going platinum blonde like this just like elevates my look big dog over here look who's here this is Andy's family dog Rocky. Rocky. It hasn't been long that fish is already eating, which is a great sign. And I'm trying to look for the other fish that we got. There's so many fish in <laughs> Sit down. Good boy. <laughs> um, so I'm sorry about the laundry noise. It is a little bit excessive, I know. But as you can see, I really enjoy being home. So the reason this vlog just took so long to make from weeks and weeks of footage. <laughs> and I just felt like I couldn't finish it because I felt like I didn't know what this vlog should be. And I just don't like making videos without like having a topic anymore. So I was a little bit struggling. But um, I realized why not call it the homebody series with me, Oliver, glimpses of Andy and our life. So yeah, I think we have a name for this series. Homebody Diaries in LA, Homebody Diaries Living in LA, something like that. My biggest flex is every Sunday, Andy's mom brings me dinner. Mm. 